then equation of energy From equation of energy, again, we can use this equation under assumption that our fluid follow Newtonian fluid. And Newtonian fluid means viscosity does change. Uh, I mean, vis viscosity does not change with respect to anything, right? So in order to use this equation correctly, the viscosity should not change at all. But in our case, viscosity does change. So using this equation is not totally tr correct. Right? If you want to do it correctly, you need to move up from this equation up one step. Okay? However, when you move it up one step, you will have rho CP dt by d term. Oops. You should go back to rho cp dt by d term equal to k Laplacian t. This is Fourier law, has nothing to do with Newtonian fluid, right? And then plus tau dot double dot v. This one We change tau here to this term using Newtonian, assumption of Newtonian fluid. If you ca cannot use Newtonian fluid, you need to bring this one back to original form in term of tau. So use double dot instead, okay? And then add by d ln rho by d ln uh, T P plus D P by D T. Okay? At steady state, this term becomes zero again. And if you assume that density is constant, this term can be dropped. The only problem is this one, right? That we cannot use Newtonian fluid. However, if you look carefully, carefully, this term can still be written as that. For this term can still be using this equation, right? The only problem is this one. But as long as you can assume that viscous heat is negligible, then this term will be dropped no matter how much it is or what kind of form they are. So this term, if you think that it is directly related to viscous heat, okay, they can still be dropped anyway. And we can still use this for derived earlier for Newtonian fluid. Because the term that is related to Newtonian fluid will be dropped eventually. All right? So looking into this equation, steady state equ assumption, this one is dropped. Vx is zero, Vy is zero, Vc is not. Temperature does change with respect to Z, this one must be kept. Temperature change with respect to X, does not change with respect to Y. Change with respect to Z, this one must be kept.
at the end, you have row CP, VZ, DT by DZ. All right. And I think we ran out of time. So I'm going to stop here and continue next on, on Friday. All right. Any question? Okay, um, last week you're supposed to submit your homework. I have not got many, so please do submit your homework as soon as possible.